Blake here with Noel Wrap Up, and I am hanging out with Emma Roberts at the H&M opening party. What's up, Emma? Hi, what's up with you? Girl, is that Isabel Marat for H&M? It is. I love it. You look good. Thank you. I'm obsessed. I tried it on, and I was like, do I get to keep this? Because I'm keeping it. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. And then I wore these shoes, which look can we fab. Get a, can, we, can we get a peek at those shoes? They look fab, but I was I was literally walking down the stairs being like, I'm out the door and almost completely tumbled down them. <laughs> I haven't worn heels in so long because in New Orleans, you walk around the streets and there's no way you can wear heels because right. you're walking five miles over like uneven pavement. So I've been really rocking my sneakers. Yeah. And so this is my first time in heels in a good two months. And it's proving to be very, very difficult. <laughs> well, I love them and I love this. And Isabel Morant would just die if she saw you. I would die if I saw Isabel Morant. I would literally, <laughs> you would have to carry me out of here in an ambulance. I'm obsessed with her. When I found out she was doing the collaboration for H&M, I literally was like, I w like went to the store and they're like, no, not now. Like it's coming out in a few months. And I was like, oh, I'm at the store already. Oh, sorry, it's a little too early. <laughs> so funny. Okay, so H&M, like great for everything. Yeah basics, whatever else. So you're in an emergency, you run into yeah. an H&M store, uh -huh. what are you buying? <laughs> well, every time I go to H&M, it's always, I have to go alone because I end up trying on 700 things and none of my friends want to wait that long. Uh -huh. So I go in alone and usually leave with like 20 things. <laughs> um, I, I, I just love it because they used to do, I feel like, more basic stuff and now they're starting to do like such cute like pattern stuff and um, I love all their accessories like hats. I love all the hats and uh, the dresses are so cute and everything fits me, which I love. Like, because a lot of times I go shop and you try stuff on and it's too big or too small or the fit's weird and their stuff, their, their small size always just fits right away. Like I just put this on and didn't have to do anything. That's awesome. Which I love because I'm really short so I have to always hem everything and this is the perfect length. I love it. Yeah. So you are in New Orleans yeah. filming American Horror Story. Your character just came back. We're so happy that she's alive. Thank you. Madison. Madison. So, I mean, what? how is your character going to develop from here throughout the rest of this, this, this season? Oh, I just want to spill everything to you because it just so, like it just gets more fabulous. But um, she develops a lot because you never really know where it's going to go with her because she has these really tender moments coming up, and then she kind of snaps back into being the snarky bitch she is. So you kind of see her going back and forth from, you know, she is. Is she a good person? Is she a bad person? Is uh -huh. she a good witch? Is she a bad witch? You don't know. So um, there'll be a lot of finding out about that. Yeah.